Finally recording. Let's go. All right, guys. Wolf Gang, what's good, guys? Your boy Chino Alpha Man. Welcome back to the channel. We're actually on my live stream setup. Uh, in case you guys don't know, I live stream over on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Chino Alpha Wolf, where I do giveaways, like sometimes gift cards and little random stuff like that uh, for all my subscribers on Twitch. And we do like, well, actually, where is it? At the end of the month, I'm actually doing. This Xbox One X giveaway at the end of the month to my most active subscriber is going to be winning this bad boy. If you guys didn't watch the other ones, I posted on my Instagram uh, the people that won, like the Beats headphones, the Apple AirPods, stuff like that. Why is this camera so freaking blurry? What's the deal, bro? All right, cool. All right, so welcome back to the channel, guys. Uh, if you're brand new to the channel, make sure you guys subscribe. Uh, and make sure you guys destroy the like button. All right, so I've gotten a couple messages Well quite a few messages from you guys asking about my opinion on this apparently I'm in the video uh, I did not watch the video yet. I'm actually gonna pull it up right now, but Apparently I'm in the video um, And this was actually just yesterday, so I have not watched this video yet Because uh, yesterday Was yesterday and I was doing that. All right, so obviously you guys know the whole situation going on between Riley and Daryl or DDG, my bad. So used to calling them that. <laughs> um, but yeah, man, it, uh, she got dropped from Zooted and it is what it is. And uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, I watched her story. I watched her, uh, her video on her channel, but I did not watch Daryl's yet um, because I'm busy myself. And I got stuff I got to do, but I have a minute now, so I'm just gonna kick back, relax, watch the video. I'm probably gonna be honest with you guys. I'm not gonna watch the whole thing because I just pulled it up, and this thing is 22 minutes, so I'm not gonna sit and watch the whole thing. I'm um, probably just gonna skim through it, and get a basic gist, and uh, I'm gonna tell y'all kind of my thoughts on where I stand and uh, how I know Riley and all that stuff. So. Um, one thing I want to say before I start is the dude in the video, in her video at least, uh, I didn't realize that was her brother. I never met him, uh, nor did I meet the boyfriend or none of that stuff, so that's all new to me. Um, but I'll, 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 I'll voice my opinion at the end of the whole career. career. What, what career? What career? What career? I really don't be liking to get into drama. I like making positive videos. This is a family channel. You know what I'm saying? This is all about positive vibes and everything. But I have been disrespected to another degree by someone that I have helped so much. And I'm gonna give y'all a backstory. And one thing about me, I don't like I like giving y'all a little bit, but I don't like putting out too much personal information on YouTube. I just don't like doing it. And I text this girl, Ryan Simpson. I text her and I told her this. Oh, she tweeted out, I'll be telling the truth of what happened on my channel tomorrow. Uh, do your thing, but it's no need to tell personal business, please. All right, don't, don't put no personal info on me. If you guys watch my video when I said, who's still in Zulu, where's Riley, all that kind of stuff, I said it in the most respectful way, we just don't work together, but y'all still go support her. She's a great person, she's a great friend. I don't know, man, it's, but I, I love Riley, you know what I mean? Me and Riley, off camera, we used to kick it all the time. Anyway, I want to say this, don't spread, stop spreading hate to Riley, man. She's a very good person, she's a beautiful person. Um, all right, look, if Daryl said that and then you still did something to piss him off, I know he's mad. <laughs> I know he's mad. Knowing Daryl, I know he's heated after that. Especially if he said he was, he was getting your back. So... Keep supporting her, man. I'm just not, we just not working together anymore. I never said anything to bash her. Now, right, this has to be, and I'm saying this in the most respectful way possible, this has to be the dumbest thing you could ever do. The, the absolute dumbest thing you could ever do. All right, I'm going to say this. It is dumb. It is actually very dumb. It's a business. It's a business contract. Obviously, if it didn't work out, it didn't work out. It is what it is, bro. Like, damn. So... What did what buttons did you push to make him mad? One thing that I saw in her video was her brother. Like who is like bro? Why the fuck was he instigating the whole time? I'm just telling you right now, Riley. It was not a good look. 
he was in the back. He was literally, I don't know what he was doing in there, but he was just on the side, literally egging on the fact that, I guess, Daryl liked you. What? Now, now I'm going to tell you all the backstory and everything. Before I get into this reaction, this video might be a little long. Get your popcorn. Go eat up some chicken. Oh! Did that sit? Yes. He's on your face. Alright, so let me call out, man. Why would you be busy for this shit? Hey. Hey, I just got a quick question. Just say yes or no. Did I buy your camera? No. Hey, I just got a super duper quick question to say yes or no on that shit. You ready? Ready. Have I, have I bought you a camera? Have you bought me a camera? Yeah. No. Huh? Alright. Yes, sir. Oh, I know what he's talking about. Yeah, did I buy you one? No. Okay, alright. Alright. Let me call Dan real quick, man. Alright. Yeah, I was literally about to say, bro. Uh, first time I ever met Riley, I swear to God, on my niece's life, bro. When I first met Riley, she was using Daryl's laptop to edit her video. All right, now, I'm gonna dive deeper into this, but she was using his laptop to edit. Her video, and this was during Silent Library, and uh, he was literally sitting there right next to her, teaching her like how to do to how to do the edits and stuff like that. May I help make this girl a YouTube channel? She literally started at absolute zero. When I met Riley, she said three thousand subscribers. Now, how I met Riley, this is what you guys need to understand. But I'm not going to specify it until I get into the reaction. How I met Riley? I met Riley, she came to one of my LA showcases, first time T.O. performed. You guys go watch that video, that's the night that I met Riley. So I was there, it was me and Valentine, we were there. She came to me, right? Uh, that was it, I met her, I seen the star potential, I was like, listen, you look like somebody. I kept telling her all now, I was like, you look like you can be somebody. I just started this company, but if you want, let's go grab like a bite to eat, let's go get a little bit of dinner or something. We went to Noble Malibu, we talked about the business, everything, woo, wah, wah, signed. And we got to work. Then she got to work again a month. Now let's get into the reaction. That is the whole backstory. That, I did not go to the club. I was at the show, but I didn't go to the club. I looked out for Riley more than any other person. That's why I'm so highly disappointed that she decided to throw dirt on my name. But we're going to get into this video without further ado. Smash the like button, subscribe, and the channel. Yeah, bro, it's six and a half minutes in. We're not in the video yet. What the f- Yeah, we need to speak to her. I'm very, very disappointed. I feel very, very disrespected. But, um, I'm going to just show y'all the video. So y'all don't even got to go watch it. Don't even go watch the video. Point blank, period. Um, but let's see. What the? All right. First of all, what the hell is this? Second of all, what's wrong with meeting in the club? Me and Valentine were in the club. What's wrong with a little bit? What's wrong with meeting somebody at the club? I met him through a friend. He a lot of, a, hold on, hold the phone. All right, if you are, over, you know, if you're over the age of 21, or if you're, you know, any club, any club, whatever age, right? 18 and up club, 21 up club. You, the, what the hell? The point is, you meet people at the club. What are you supposed to do? I can't I oh! See that okay, the whole liking thing that I don't get. Because the brother on the side was like constantly hyping that up. Like he liked her. He he like when they met I thought it was like he liked her and well he really did help her. What are you doing in the video? That's what I don't get, coach. What are you doing in the video? 
I'm talking about her brother. I never met the dude. But what were you doing in the video? What is that? Or the boyfriend? What? Is oh, he needs some milk. This is very, this is very unfortunate. This is disappointing. I don't want you. Right. If I wanted you, like I, like when I was watching her video, the the uh, the brother was always hyping up the fact that, like they were revolving around the point that he like, she or no, Daryl liked her. Could have you. <clears throat> despite you having a boyfriend, despite of anything, point blank period. If I wanted you, I could have had you. And you know that. We both know that. First time that T.O. performed, if you guys want to go back and find it. I met Riley that night. She came to the little LA showcase with one of my homies. It was a nigga that was in the Cloud Chase video, actually. He was in the Cloud Chase music video. And when I seen her, I was like, you look, look like you can be somebody. somebody. That was basically it. I was like, you look, look like you can be somebody. Like, Ooh. Now, I'm, I'm not going to sit here and act like Riley is ugly. She's not ugly, okay? But in reality, Riley, you're not fucking with any of my exes. You're not fucking with any girls that I really do mess with. I'm not attracted to you like that. I wouldn't put my neck out online. That's why I did business with you. I don't want 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 you. I have no, no I had no, no intentions of messing with you. You've been on this couch right here. I'm talking about Riley has been in my house until like one in the morning. Don't, don't touch her. Swear to God on my life. I never touched Riley, never kissed her, never hugged her, nothing. I can put that on the bike. I never did anything, anything to even try Riley or even spark that interest in her mind. And when you was out here, Riley, you was messing with a lot of other dudes. Oh, you was talking about, talk about your boy problems. problems. And, and then you went to Chicago, and you started dating this dude. Which is cool. cool. And, and what did I tell you? I told, I told you, Riley, you fill with him. You gonna, gonna make a lot of money. Y'all two light skins. skins. They, they like light skins on this platform. Fill with him. Get a lot of views. You think I was jealous? My bad. Let me pause this real quick. Just make this make sense. Riley, if that is true, if I'm jealous of you having a boyfriend, why am I working with Seven who has a whole family? Why am I working with a lot that has a whole boyfriend? Why am I signing Danny? He's a whole dude. Belly. Something don't sound right. Your time has come. You're done, you're done, you're done. You're right at 50k. And you're going to move times and then you go out on a contract type deal with the I already saw all this. I don't want you. I promise you I don't want you. I promise you. I'm flattered that you thought that. You're going to shoot me a lot of men, a lot of men, a lot of men. What what there's a lot of people who always want to give up to you, a lot of men, a lot of men, a lot of men. Who are you? Who are you? And why are you in the video? This has nothing, nothing to, do to do with you. I don't, I don't even know, know your name. name. Bro, listen. The, the amount of money, money that I made off Riley can't, can't pay, pay the bill that I have. Nah. Not, Not even a fraction of it. Like, like, I, like, like the, the mama money that I were, Let me tell you, okay, okay, let me give you a little backstory so you get personal. Riley, right? you was a personal assistant when I met you. You, you had no YouTube. You had 3,000 followers on Instagram. Oh, okay. You were probably making, I don't know how much you was making, but you, I remember you told me. You was probably making like $3,000, $4,000 a month. Maybe. No, no but probably like $3,000 a month. Doing, doing your personal assistant job, job right? Uh, the, the first, first month of me and you working, you made over twenty three thousand dollars. The second month, month you made over sixteen thousand dollars. Sixteen. When we stopped, stopped working, working, you made four thousand. In that month, then you made three thousand. Uh, and for the month of April, you made six hundred dollars, right? Oh, two Opportunity? Are you serious? Don't ever disrespect my business like that. Don't disrespect my business model or anything. I made you into a boss, a superstar. 
point blank, blank period, it's disrespectful for you to come over here and try to talk, talk down on my name like I had to put hella money, money in your pocket. What's, What's wrong with you? <laughs> Alright. Now, now I'm honestly getting pissed, pissed bro. So I can read the following in my friend Chuck pretty much. And before that, he would give a percentage of money or whatever I make. Rightfully so. Right, because it's business. It's business. If you if, look, let me tell let me put it like this. Let me make it this clear and simple. Look. Let's say YouTube, right? God damn, why are you so blurry? Let's say it's YouTube, for an example. Why are you so blurry, bitch? Look, dog, I'm not playing with you. Open your fucking eyes. Now I'm getting mad. Open your eyes! Thank you. Okay, now, sorry I had to do that. Let's say YouTube, for an example, right? Let's say YouTube told me, post the video every single day. Yes, I have to do it. I have to edit it. I have to come up with the idea, and I have to post it. And in turn, YouTube will pay me. Now, if I tell YouTube, fuck you, what is YouTube going to do? What are they going to say? And we have, and let's say there's a contract. What are they going to say? Nothing. They're going to say absolutely nothing. You know what they're going to do? They're going to go to their desk. They're going to walk over in the big giant delete button. They're going to click that bitch and my channel's gone. If you don't want to, if you don't, if you have to put in the work, regardless. It don't matter if you work at Walmart, you still have to put in the work. You made an agreement. You gotta do it yourself, just because, if Walmart's like, hey, you gotta uh, organize the shelves, and you gotta uh, mop the floor, and you gotta do that, bitch. And what is their job? They gonna make you some cheese. What more do you expect? It's business. Yes, 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 yes. Welcome to the industry of business. Fuck my brain. What else do you do? If I go and apply at Popeye and Popeye's is saying, hey, you gotta cook this bitch, you gotta serve it out the window, and then you, you gotta clean the toilet. You gotta do that. I'm gonna show you how to do it, but you gotta do it. And then what am I going to do? I'm going to pay you, is what Popeye said. Bet! It sounds like a good deal to me! Belly roll! I'm like, of course, okay? Yeah. I edited a few of Riley's videos. That's, That's not, not in the contract. contract. I do, I do stuff, stuff like that. that. I, I did, did so, so much, much for this girl, girl. Like, I, I literally, literally created, created the video. Let me tell you something, bro. When I came on YouTube, bro, People like Daryl did not exist, okay? There was no contract. There's only literally MCNs. You know what MCN is? People that take your bread. Anyways, there was nobody that was doing that kind of stuff. You know what I'm saying? I swear to God, when I was starting on YouTube, there was nobody doing stuff like that. Now you got like Jake Paul and all this other stuff where you could sign and you will help you grow your YouTube channel. But there's nobody like that or doing that kind of stuff. You know what I'm saying? But Daryl is like right next to her. And I'm telling you, when we were doing the uh, silent library, I invited Daryl over and he was literally right next to her on his computer editing her video, helping her edit her video. Edit the video for her, upload the video, let it alone. I'm just stating facts. Made her channel with Like I literally set her down, made her Gmail, created her YouTube channel. Got her a uh, profile, profile picture, picture, a YouTube, YouTube banner. I literally created, created the whole channel and I edited some, some of your videos. And I brought you around, around my family. Matter of fact, let me make a call real quick. Oh my god. Hello? Hey, let me ask you a quick question. Oh, by the way, I uh, was with Nate and I was driving, so. That's why it was difficult for me to speak. <laughs> yeah. You remember when, when we did, did the, um, the, the Simon Library video? video? Yeah. What, what did, did I, I say? say? Remember, remember you asked me to pull up? What, what did, did I, I say? say? I, said I said I'm, I'm not, not pulling up if who can't, can't come. I'm not pulling up if what? When we, we did, did that Simon Library video, I told, I told you I'm, I'm not pulling up to do the video with you unless who can't come. come. Oh, 
video like this man uh at the end of the day man business is business as simple as that you know uh and you can't be ungrateful for what you have you always be grateful for what you have if somebody is look let me tell you bro when i when i started in the youtube game uh I, nobody let me use their laptop nobody sat me down and taught me how to edit bro i learned myself you know i'm saying there's a difference Somebody teaching, that's, I'd be grateful for that. <laughs> I, did it, I did it myself, you know what I'm saying? Daryl did it himself, we all did it ourselves. And if he's sitting down teaching you, you gotta be grateful. You know? And when it comes to the, the business side, there's two sides, of it, right? Business and personal. When it comes to the business side, it is what it is. They gonna help you out and put money in your pocket and you're gonna both eat. Does he really need your cheese? No. He's got. He's been had his own cheese, but he's gonna help you grow. And let me just add this in real quick. Okay. Ah. Uh, let's say I work at Walmart for an example, right? The CEO is not gonna sit down and teach me things, right? A manager is. But Daryl's a one one man army, and you're at the start of. You ever work for a startup company? Because I've worked for a startup company. I've worked for a lot of jobs. Because I'm old. Now, when you're in a startup company, there's going to be this thing called growing pains, right? You're not going to always get 100% of the attention, especially from the owner. For somebody to sit down and, 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 and teach you, that alone says a lot. Okay? I guarantee if I go get a job at Target, I'll never meet the CEO of that bit. I'm just gonna see the, the weak ass managers over there. And they're still gonna just be like, okay, this is what you gotta do, and then you're gonna make money. And then you get paid this time. But they're not gonna sit there and hold my hand and be like, you gotta rub and clean, like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. they're not gonna sit there and hold your hand the whole time the whole time. <laughs> they got other business to attend to. That was, I'm assuming that was the agreement, you know? He helps you, you help him, and you guys just grow. And, and, and if there's the personal side, emotions, and oh my gods, and whole fun, and then you, you fall in love with Chicago, and all that stuff happens, you leave that outside of the business stuff, but at the end of the day, you have to work, period. I gotta work. My girlfriend's gotta work. We all gotta work. You know what I'm saying? Who's gonna who's gonna edit my videos? Doug, Ty, Vaughn, Daryl? No, I'm gonna edit. Just like you gotta do it. If I, like I said, if I go work at Popeye, who's gonna clean the bathroom? I gotta do it. That's what I'm getting paid to do. So that that part is irrelevant. And the whole lovey dovey, oh he likes him, he likes that. Bro, there's so many people all the time DMing and, oh my God, and leave that stuff out of it, bro. It is what it is. Business is business. And at the end of the day, if you don't want to be a part of it, it's over with. It's over with. <laughs>